I don't even know if this message will get to you. If I'd known it would end like this, I wouldn't have come here. Oh, oh damn it, damn it, damn it! Oh, cover for me, Jess. Copy that. I don't expect you to understand. Everything I've done was for you guys. I know. Excuses mean nothing now. I've never doubted myself or thought I could fail. Same for this job. I would do anything to be back home. Anything. I have no regrets. I will always make the same decision. I will always provide for my family. No matter what. Trust no one. Ever. owned by Shad Enterprise are suffering merciless attacks from the extremist organization La Main. They pose us with a greater challenge by infiltrating frontier missions in cooperation with traitors, manipulating and spreading hostility among frontiers, leading them to their demise. All of that to get their hands on the invaluable Keystones. Keystone is a new type of matter discovered by Shad, the new generation of energy source that will brighten the path to a prosperous future for humanity. Your mission as a loyal space frontier is to destroy all energy cubes in the mission area. Failure is not an option. If any energy cube is not destroyed in time, it will collapse onto itself and result in a massive explosion. You must, at all costs, destroy all energy cubes and protect the keystones from falling into the hands of the traitor and Blamon! Bla me! Bla me! <clears throat> Only with Shad's boundless dedication and Space Frontier's assistance can we preserve humanity's sole hope of survival! New Columbia! 
maybe you'll get some monetary compensation and a certificate, and maybe even a shiny badge. I don't know. Let's just go to the Frontier Training Center already! Hi, I'm Kirsten Swan, Space Frontier Operator. You probably don't want to go overtime here. I certainly don't. So let's get started with Space Frontier 101. I've set up this area to simulate the mission environment. First things first. You can check your health and oxygen level on your info. If your health reaches zero, you'll be knocked out, or under some circumstances, die. You can also check your oxygen level and the number of oxygen cans. Once an oxygen can is used, it is discarded automatically. So don't bother finding used up cans to throw away and make space in your inventory. Okay, you don't want to suffocate to death. So hurry on and fix the oxygen supply system before you use up all oxygen you have. Go through the door to repair it. To fix the oxygen supply system, you need to repair all faulty oxygen generators. You can repair an oxygen generator by aligning the needles inside the glowing zone for each of the three scales. done. Now let's go on to the next room and restore power by using the power supply device. Once you're on the site, there's no guarantee that power is being supplied without problems. Keep that in mind, you're gonna need the power restored to complete your mission. You may need to repair external power sources in some situations, but for now, let's just bring the power back online. When power is restored, it'll speed up the energy cube destruction process. You also need power to activate the space shuttle launcher for the final extraction. Now, let's look for a keycard. Move to the next room and you'll find a dummy body you can examine. Took me long enough. You just picked up a mission keycard. You'll need to find all mission keycards for any Frontier mission. By the way, while you hold a vital mission item, it'll draw a guided path to where it can be used. But it'll also expose you with a highlighted glow, meaning that the trader will be able to see you wherever you are, so keep that in mind. Now, go to the next room and retrieve the energy cube. You can use your Avtor to override certain locks or gates. You know, the multi-purpose device we basically provide for Frontier missions? You'll have to hack the transmitter with the right keycard in order to disconnect the energy cube for safe removal. Press the button when the progress bar is at the red scale, and your Avtor will do the rest. You'll still be visible to others while you're working on it, so be aware of your surroundings. Here we go. Successfully hack the transmitter, you can safely remove the energy cube and the keystone inside it. Remember, keystones are what the trader is after. Don't forget them! When all energy cubes are pulled out of the transmitters, 
a self-destruct sequence is activated. It's a training session right now, so... Oh, great! Just what we needed! A hallway filled with toxic gas. How delightful! That's toxic keystone gas. It's lethal enough to put down any living person within seconds. Don't worry, though. You can usually find a valve nearby these leaks to close Where them Where was it? Let's take care of that before we move on. Where was I? Oh, yes. Your main objective is to destroy all the energy cubes within the space station and escape. Pick the energy cube back up and follow the guided path that leads you to its designated destructor. In order to operate a destructor, you'll need to have an energy cube or any required parts that is missing. First, select a component to work with. The destructor will start the packaging process automatically. Find the ones that are turning yellow, move the stabilizer to that section, and press the button. You'll be vulnerable to any stealth attacks, so try to do a good job while you're at it to save time and yourself. destroy an energy cube, you'll need to go through this process with all four components. The energy cube, a battery, a carbon fiber, and a sensor. Thanks to your great work, we just need one last part. There's a room next door you haven't checked yet. Take a You'll come across cabinets in mission areas you're assigned to. The cabinets are likely to store parts or items you'll need for the mission. So, there's no harm in searching them. Now that you have the last part you needed, let's go back to the destructor and finish it up. Okay, all good to go. Go on to activate the shuttle launcher now. Even while you're activating the launcher, the trader can still try and escape using an escape pod. But if you manage to finish the activation before the trader can escape, Blaming will probably just cut the trader loose and get rid of them. the shuttle to officially finish the basic frontier training program so we
Going with the flow, my flow. All right. That should do it. Thank you. 
All energy cubes in this station have been removed. They must be destroyed in five minutes. remaining for energy cube destruction. Four minutes. Time remaining for energy cube destruction. Three minutes. Time remaining for energy cube destruction. Two minutes. Time remaining for energy cube destruction. One minute. Dust to dust.